From the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas, this is an ITTV special report. What kind of entertainment can you enjoy on internet TV that you can't enjoy on regular TV? Well, our next guest has uh, all kinds of insight into your personal music collection ability to enjoy it even more. He is the CEO of M-Spot, Darren Sway. Darren, welcome back into tomorrow. How you doing? Good, thanks Dave, nice to see you again. It's a pleasure to see you as well, and you're always coming up with fun things, so we gotta find out what is the latest. How does M-Spot solve that problem for us about enjoying the kind of entertainment that we can't otherwise get? Right, well, uh, M-Spot is a cloud-based entertainment com company. We offer radio, music, movie services. Um, and, and what I mean by cloud is, for example, if you uh, were to rent a movie from our service, a new release, you have the ability to take that single rental and then watch it on a television, on a pad, on a smartphone, on a PC computer, you name it. Wow. So the, the idea here is that we feel going forward there are, there are going to be a lot of connected devices yeah. and people want to enjoy entertainment regardless of the device that they're on. And that's kind of what we do. And same thing with music as well. On the music service, you can upload your music to the cloud, to the M-Spot cloud. Once it's there, same thing. Access to uh, your music across all those devices that I just previously mentioned. And of course, the key is we've got to be connected now. We can, it's not storing stuff on a device, a TV show we wanted to catch while I'm on a flight or something like that, or do right. we have that capability as well? Well, and so we need to split the product up when we're talking about syncing. Oh, okay. On the movie side today, we're streaming only. We are working on what we call the cash and carry feature so that you can actually take the movie onto the plane with you. That's, That's coming clever, out very cash shortly. and carry. Thank I you. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to rent a movie, why shouldn't I be able to get it and take it with me at my leisure? Half the time, that's a problem in the air. I don't have entertainment. A absolutely, and you know, we focus a lot on portable devices. As, as we know, the cellular networks are getting better, but there are still spotty oh, uh, uh, yeah. you know, that's coverages. An, that's an understatement. <laughs> uh, so, so therefore, the cash and carry feature is really compelling. On the music side, however, uh, we are today already syncing music as well as streaming music. Good. So for example, if you're accessing your music from a, from a browser on a PC, that would be streaming. But if you had a portable device, for example, an Android phone there that I see as sure. well as an iPhone, we do uh, offer the ability to sync as well. So again, you can take it on a plane with you. I love it. Now see there, as you do more and more of that, I'm, I'm, no, I'm convinced that that's what a lot of our listeners are going to want more and more of. Right. Again, you're already spending the money, you're buying it or renting it, whatever, then why shouldn't I be able to literally enjoy it anywhere, anytime at my convenience? So. Uh, I, I think that's exactly right. And I, again, I, I, I think this uh, issue about being able to access your entertainment on any device um, it, it's going to be increasingly more complicated as there are more connected devices. Oh, sure, yeah. And so we're basically here to support whether it's a Windows platform or an Android platform or an Apple platform, you name it. You know, we're going to be able to uh, allow our services to be enjoyed on those devices. Good, and that's where you hit the nail on the M spot. <laughs> <Because> <laughs> that's right. Because it's perfect. It, does the M, let me guess, stand for mobile? Well, see, the, here's the clever part. It could be mobile, it could be movies, it could be music. Oh, so either way, it's almost like a 3M spot, but don't <laughs> confuse it, it's M spot. That's the important thing. Right. Now, is this a paid service? Uh, so on the movie side it is. Okay. Um, for our library title, it's around two ninety nine per rental. You have 24 hours to watch it as many times as you like. Again, you can start it on a PC and then finish it on your smartphone. Gotcha. Um, on a new release, it's about three ninety nine. So it's pretty reasonable, and True. we don't force folks to be in a subscription. On the music side, however, it's great. You can actually access the service for free. We give you two gigabytes of storage, so you can st store as many songs as you want, up to two gigabytes. In the event that you have a large music library and you need more storage, we uh, charge a nominal fee there. Okay, and yeah. it makes sense because if, if I'm going to load up your server with you know 20 gigabytes or something, then right. I should pay a little something for that. Yeah. So we hope that the people really like the, the free tier enough so that they're willing to actually go, go into the pay tier. Sure. Now, will that uh, upcoming cash and carry model for movies, for example, hopefully go more than 24 hours? Because if I'm planning a trip, you know, I might want to rent something and have it right. and not watch it for another day or, or maybe on the trip back or something. Actually, you know? just to be clear, when you rent something, you actually have 30 days to start the movie. Oh, okay. So once you start the movie, then you have 24 hours after that to keep enjoying it. Excellent. So. All right. Well, you guys are thinking of everything, and I appreciate <laughs> that. And I think our audience is thinking, see, we're getting there. We're finally getting there. M Spot, the letter M Spot. Dot com. Very easy site to get to. Darren, thank you, as always, for joining us on Into Tomorrow. Thanks, Dave.